my friends and welcome to bronco aviation for this evening's live flight which will take us from oslo gardermoen airport down to uh, ljubljana in slovenia we will be flying bronco airways today our very own airline in-house airline and a livery made by our own member longtime subscriber liam with his fantastic job on his livery and i don't know guys what you think but i think he made an amazing job uh, Phoenix aircraft, A320-200 for this flight. Uh, we have a flight time about 2 hours and 40 minutes for this flight. Uh, there is an VATSIM event going on here in Oslo airport today. So we are fully covered with ATC, which will be a very pleasant uh, flight today. All right, let me say hello to you, my friends. I hope you are doing well this evening and hope you had a great week. Uh, good evening, Transport Legends. Welcome on board. Engineer on board, Christos. Good evening. Welcome, Engineer on board. Uh, and good evening to you, Luxe Flight. Welcome uh, all of you guys. And uh, yeah, lots of looking forward to this flight. Uh, the one amazing thing which I will showcase later is that we have our very own custom uh, cabin or safety announcement also made by liam uh will be quite a surprise for you guys i really think he nailed it and did it very good all right my friends let's jump in the aircraft uh, as i said uh, we have uh, we are in osto Moon airport lots of aircrafts taking off from here today and also arriving so quite nice always always nice when it's busy Let's jump inside and uh, start to prepare our aircraft for departure. So, uh, let's go to overhead panel and turn the external power on. Also, we need some uh, sound on. There we go. And battery one and battery two goes on. Uh, Pedro Papiano, welcome my friend, welcome to the stream. Uh, Pedro, there isn't a better introduction than the introduction of the Bronco. <laughs> well, thank you, thank you. I'm also very happy about that. It's quite nice intro and I hope you feel welcome, my friend. Uh, okay, strobe lights goes on, navlog lights goes on, if you must switch. Ice indication, uh, let's uh, have a little dim lights in the cabin, seatbelt sign, no smoking lights and emergency exit light is on. Uh, Miss Patrullen, hey Miss Patrullen, welcome to the stream. Uh, Oslo to Slovenia, now this should be an interesting flight. Yeah, I think so too. I have never landed in Slovenia before. Uh, we have taken off from Oslo a couple of times before, also landed here a couple of times, but we've never been to Slovenia. Uh, we have also paver scenery for that airport as well. Uh -huh. And uh, all right, as I said, uh, this should be quite busy today. And uh, let's uh, import the flight plan. Miss <laughs> Patula, what the F was that scream? Uh, that was somebody because I'm connected to ATC and it was my 
unicorns. Somebody, I don't know, somebody screamed in their microphone for some reason. Okay, 26 minutes for, before the departure. Ground service is looking good. GPU is connected. Let's go to mass and balance. And let's uh, load up the aircraft. We have planned of 169 passengers for this flight. And uh, we're gonna load up with the GSX. Also, my friends, don't forget to hit that like button. It always helps the stream and is very appreciated by me, your own pilot, Bronco. Uh, Luxe Flight, a very beautiful livery by Liam. Very good work. Yes, indeed, indeed. Uh, Talkman, is the Bronco announcement out now? Yes, we will play the Bronco announcement just when we start uh, to push back. So uh, you will hear. <laughs> For you who hasn't he heard it, I had it on my Discord presented by Liam before. So I will uh, play the uh, <laughs> custom announcement for Bronco Airlines or Bronco Airways. Uh, Miss Patrolem, Slovenia is such a tiny country. I bet you'll be able to fly over it in a couple of minutes. Probably the same as Slovakia when we flew over that country. It only took 10 minutes. Yeah, it's quite small country. It's former Republic of uh, Yugoslavia. Uh, talking about how uh, don't spoil don't spoil anything how it was to how did he get the voice i don't know how did he get it but uh, just keep calm man we're gonna play the cabin announcement when we start our pushback as i said it's uh, <laughs> it's quite something <laughs> Uh, transport legend hello bronco hello transport legend hello my friend uh, uh, sorry i thought it was saturday i have no idea why I don't ask questions anyways how are you doing today good i hope all aboard yes thank you for asking i'm very good today so happy to be here and flying with you guys always always a, a great pleasure uh, pedro guys enjoy the orbex oslo scenarios with a discount in the marketplace it is okay okay so hurry and download it guys if you don't have orbex uh, oslo airport i can strongly recommend it very beautiful scenery for this airport Uh, Miss Patron, the only Yugoslavian country that doesn't feel it, it's a former Yugoslavian country, more feels like Austria or some other Central European country. You mean, you mean Slovenia? Well, I have never been to Slovenia, so I cannot share your thoughts. I don't know if, yeah, if it's that, maybe it's that. I mean, I'm actually, I'm born in former Yugoslavia. I'm born in Serbia, and, but at the time when I was born, it was Yugoslavia at that time. But sadly, I have never been to Slovenia. And Adis Malbegovic, pozdrav, good evening, pozdrav Adis Malbegovic, welcome on board, dobro došao. Uh, let's press init request. So we are also waiting IRS to be aligned, we have five minutes until that's done. Have we start? Yes, passengers are boarded, they're almost finished. 115 passengers already boarded, so it goes quite fast. And we have, because we are flying as well with Bronco Airways today, we have our own call sign, which is Bronco 780. And uh, cost index for this flight is uh, 41. And the cruising altitude is, uh, we're going to cruise at flight level 340 today.
Uh, talking Ben, why is it so many in Oslo right now? Well, it's uh, it's an announced VATSIM event, so there at ATC they uh, have full coverage of the Oslo uh, airport. So there's both both delivery ATC, ground ATC, as well as uh, towers. So that's why. O always when these these uh, events are happening, always gathers lots and lots of uh, sim pilots. Mm, transport legend I'm flying right now, Captain Sim Triple Seven, British Airways. Okay, New York JFK, London Heathrow, just over two hours in. Started to get rough, but I'm way too professional to just turn off my PC during flight. Well, <laughs> then you have quite a lot left to fly, man. Uh, let's see. The wind is uh, inserted. Okay, so now we are only waiting for uh, passengers and fuel to be loaded. And we're also waiting for uh, IRS to be aligned. They're gonna... Uh, <coughs> actually, we can switch to the frequency of uh, the delivery, which, which is 121-930. One, one, uh, Okay, Ben, what runway are you going to uh, take off? Isn't one for just landing? Do you know if I'm right? Well, they have announced uh, that the both runway 1 and 9 left and w runway 1 9 and right are operational for both landing and takeoffs. So I have uh, filed a flight plan where we take off runway 1 9 left, but it's not 100% uh, sure. We will see what clearance we get. So, But uh, the initial plan is runway 1 9 left. I trust my ledger. Oh, what's the event? I was wondering why Oslo Airspace was absolutely jammed full. Yeah, that's why, man. Miss Patron, I wonder how many months ahead my requested flight is. Well, maybe not months. I will say weeks. Somewhere between five, seven weeks. So maybe one to two months, I, could, I would say. Okay, so they have switched frequency. Delivery is actually at one to one. That's must six eight zero. That's why I couldn't hear anybody. Okay, let's switch back. And it's uh, one to one six eight zero. There we go. Max Tango, Garmo delivery, good evening. Uh, correction, uh, hold position, contact ground, frequency 1 to 1, that's my 605. Okay, let's let, just let me double check uh, what we need to know. 80s information. And our QNH is 1010. One, 
And we have information key low. All right. Let's contact the ATC. Government clearance, good evening. Bronco 780 at flight uh, at stand uh, 20 with information kilo request the clearance uh, to uh, Ljubljana. Bronco 7, correction uh, 780, guard mode delivery. Hello, clear to destination Vipa 6 Delta departure. Runway one nine right, climb seven thousand, walk four two seven one. Uh, clear to Ljubljana via the VIPA 6 Delta departure, runway 19 right. Uh, climb flight level, the uh, uh, 7000 feet, squawk 4271, Bronco 780. Bronco 780, red back collector report, and ready for push and start. Okay. They have switched the runway, which is uh, so take off from runway 19 right. So initial climb will be 7,000 feet, and we need to squawk, uh, what was that? Let me see, 4271. Lot uh, for Red Fox, Trot, say again. Lot uh, for Red Fox, Trot, uh, hold position, contact ground, 3 one 2 one Have a good day, Lot for Red Fox, So, 1-9 right. And the uh, departure was uh, VIP and 6 at Delta departure. Okay, let's find that one. There we go. Uh, Ljubljana, there is only, strange enough, we can only land at uh, runway 30. So you cannot land in the opposite way when you approach Ljubljana, which is, I have never seen that before. And we're gonna go with ILS 30, and the star for that is Radley to Lima. There we go. Let's check the pen. Nine five two is ready for push and start. Scan an island 952, hold position, ground 1165. Hold position, ground 1165 for scanning 952, follow. Uh, Musti, did you have build your PC? No. Uh, well, <laughs> I have bought a pre built PC by a company, but uh, now my PC is more than three years old now, and I have switched out certain parts by myself, so. Uh, it's a mix of both uh, and you can see my specs if you check the, the, the stream uh, description so just scroll down uh, through the description and you will see uh, which specs I have uh, Mr. You, uh, you have 1490 I suppose that wasn't so cheap actually crazy enough I got it for free but not completely free because I had 1390 before it and uh, during the warranty which was three years uh, i had three year warranty on my rtx 1390 uh, the rtx 1390 broke down so i had it replaced with the new graphics card and since the 3090 was not being made anymore so they had to s send me something similar so i received a 1490 for free so <laughs> very lucky there but uh, yeah There we go, flight plan is set. Aircraft is loaded, both fuel and the passengers are loaded, perfect. <laughs> Musti, <laughs> you're a good Swedish Serbian hustler. 
<laughs> thank you, thank you. Good evening, could be there 514 at 1044 information. Fox shot request grant to Brass, please. Vi ser Firebond 2, okay, eller Garbo for Nevening, det är en kryp till Prag och satt till Charlie, då bara sedan det var med en elektrik. Vi ska starta EPU. 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 Vi ska Is there one on the fire on for it? I correct the report was there. I didn't put it up. Oh, it's so loud outside. Uh, Musti, uh, I built my PC but it kept crashing, so I had to return my graphics card. I recently built it last Friday and my new graphics card should become this Friday. Okay, okay, I ha hope you get your graphics card and everything will be alright, Musti. Uh, however, Amazon is a real hell with the refunds. Oh no, man, you've bought through Amazon. Then I understand why it takes some time. Uh, well, their customer service is uh, not the best. It's not even good. It's really bad, I heard. Amazon customer service is uh, mm, not good, man. Musti, my dad wanted to kill me. I spent 16,600 kronos on it. <laughs> okay. Okay. Uh, seven, uh, 7,800 XD. Okay, so you have AMD graphics cards, 2 terabytes, 32 gigabytes of RAM, AMD Ryzen 7,600, and so much other stuff. Well, you know, uh, hardware is expensive, man. Uh, you, you never get out. If you want a really good hardware built PC that at least, I mean, if you want to do some the high or ultra settings in Microsoft Flight Simulator, then uh, it's going to cost, man. It's, it's for sure going to cost. Uh, oh, where were I? Okay, I forgot. We need to set up the init B page. Uh, let's see. We set up the weight 60.0. Delivery, uh, this is Honda Jet Hotel Zulu 410. Uh, uh, generally, slash, uh, what do we have? Uh, 31.9. Uh, requesting delivery. Clear. Hotel, I'm um, for 1.0. Uh, uh, delivery. Good evening. Uh, are you flying VFR or IFR today? IFR. Uh, must uh, I uh, regret it? Uh, I'll need a flight plan for you. Uh, please refund. Sorry for that. Yeah, I regret One I second. bought most of my expensive stuff there because I wanted to save a couple of hundred kronos. I regret now. Yeah, I can understand that. Sometimes the cheaper is not the better. But I understand if you're on a budget, you want to buy it as cheap as you can. Uh, but uh, yeah, take it like this. It's a lesson learned, man. Okay, okay. Let's go. APU is available. Let's see. It. APU bleed is on. There we go. And uh, let's set the performance. Uh, let's go down here. Departure performance. And departure is 19 right. Uh, let's synchronize the load sheet and the white live weather. And let's calculate. Uh, takeoff will be with flaps 1. Uh, 157, 157, and 158. Let's send it to MCDU. Okay, that is set as well. So the aircraft is uh, complete and I think we are ready for pushback, I think. First of all, need to just set the correct frequency for our um, ground will be one to one decimal six zero five uh what is the four one zero flight plan file the two Berlin 
Clear to Berlin, uh, we are one nine left runway, Oxac to Charlie, Squawk four five five seven, Hotel Zulu four one zero. Hotel Zulu four one zero, negative. Oxac six Delta departure runway one nine right, climb seven thousand, Squawk four five five seven. Departure be Oxac. Mostly I said 600 crowns for buying on Amazon, but my graphics card was a living hell. Uh, well, I once had an AMD graphics card, it was way, way back many years ago. And uh, since then, I had that one, I said never again AMD. Now, I think the quality is better nowadays. Uh, not everyone has those troubles as you have, but um, yeah, that's what, all I can say about AMD cards. I, I don't know anything about them today. So, but I'm sorry to hear that, man. Musti, do you prefer smaller and regional airports such as Salzburg, Ljubljana, or you like more bigger ones such as Heathrow, Abu Dhabi, and etc.? I think I'm like a regional, smaller regional. Uh, embedded in mountains with small, uh, small runways. I think it's much, much more fun to land on and depart from. Station calling for push and start, call sign only. Uftansa 863. Lufthansa 86. Hold position, contact ground, frequency 121, that's 1605. Hold position and ground 121, that's 1605, thank you. Bronco 780 is ready for push and start. Bronco 780, hold position, contact ground, frequency 121, that's 1605. Ground 121, that's 1605, thank you, bye bye. Bronco 780. Okay, we switched to frequency. Can you one zero one zero, and you want to face north, or can be facing east? Uh, for the eight six three, it's uh, just a straight pushback. Uh, yeah, there should be some uh, white line on the ground if you have uh, some paper scenery. So just push onto that, uh, not even on delta. Oh, so we do a straight push. Ground Moon Ground, good evening. Uh, Bronco 780 at stand 20 is uh, ready for push and start. Call sign. Uh, there's, uh, okay. There are pictures for the pushback uh, procedures we have here, and also it's quite special compared to other airfields. Walked. Yep, and what 863, if you check the information under my call sign, uh, we have a link with all the pictures for our pushback positions. It's quite uh, special at so you might want to check that out, but it's fine. Roger, uh, I will check out. Thank you. Okay. Karamoran, uh, ground, good evening. Bronco 780 at stand 20 is ready for push and start. Uh, Bronco 780, Karamoran, ground, hello, push and start approved, QNH 1010. Push and start approved, uh, QNH 1010, Bronco 780. Okay, guys, be ready for uh, custom uh, for safety announcement, which will begin as ta soon as we start our push. And remember, this is not me talking in real time. This is not me even have recorded uh, this, uh, <laughs> this cabin announcement or safety announcement. This is purely made by our uh, friend Liam. Uh, I don't know how he did that. Somehow uh, he took my voice. Uh, you will hear my voice, but as I said, I wasn't even aware uh, aware that he was doing this. So listen closely, guys.
Current, good evening, uh, Nordic 54, uh, Tango Druid at stand uh, 65, request uh, push and start. Welcome aboard Bronco Airways, where safety is our top priority and humor is our co-pilot. Before we embark on our journey, we kindly ask for your attention as we go through some important safety information. Please fasten your seatbelt by inserting the metal end into the buckle and adjust it to fit snugly across your lap. For those of you who have trouble locating your seatbelt, well, if you're sitting on it, it might be a bit tricky. In that case, just give it a little dig, it'll reveal itself eventually. Take a moment to locate the nearest emergency exit. It might be behind you, beside you, or right in front of you, depending on where you're seated. In case of an emergency, follow the illuminated escape path to the nearest exit. And remember, the exit doors are not only there for dramatic exits, they're actually pretty handy in emergencies. If the cabin pressure drops, oxygen masks will drop from the overhead compartments. Please secure your own mask before assisting others. If you're traveling with children or someone acting like a child, please attend to yourself first. Oxygen is a fantastic thing, but we recommend breathing it in, not hogging it. In the unlikely event of a water landing, your seat cushion can be used as a flotation device. Just slip it over your head and embrace the buoyancy. But hey, if you're more of a keep my feet dry kind of person, life jackets are located under your seat. Pull the straps, inflate the jacket, and voila, you're ready to float and maybe even make some new fish friends. Please switch off all electronic devices or set them to airplane mode for the duration of the flight. We know it's tough to part with your gadgets, but hey, it's either that or deal with the awkward silence of the guy next to you trying to start a conversation about the weather. I'm looking here. Smoking is strictly prohibited on this flight, including electronic cigarettes. If you absolutely must have a nicotine fix, kindly step outside the aircraft and take a long walk. You might as well enjoy the view while you're at it. As we prepare for takeoff, we ask that you please stow your tray tables, put your seat backs in the upright position, and make sure your carry-on baggage is securely stowed. Sit back, relax, and enjoy the flight. Thank you for choosing Bronco Airways, where flying is both safe and slightly entertaining. Let's soar through the skies together. <laughs> What about that, guys? What about that? Uh, that was us very own custom made cabin announcement. Hey, we pushed way too not too far. Uh, Paul Major, good evening. <laughs> good evening, Paul Major. Welcome to the stream. And Mike. Okay, engine is up and running. Let's switch to normal. On the ground spoilers. Auto brake set to max. APU bleed off, APU master switch off. Taxi lights. There we go. Run is um, in my left uh, cross pushing a hole. So it flaps what? You didn't block uh, the taxiway, but uh, I can give you a different uh, route. So, so taxi via hotel and uh, mic, uh, that's gonna be easier as well. Hotel and mic, thank you very much. Okay, now we need just uh, some uh, tax instructions and we'll be on our way. Got him on ground, the Bronco 780. Sorry for the push, it was uh, bugged out for me, but uh, we are ready for taxi. Uh, Bronco 780, this push, ex uh, push is actually perfect. Uh, taxi are like Bernard 198 via Golf and November Alpha 7 available. Uh, taxi to runway 19 right via Golf November Alpha 7, uh, Bronco 780. Okay, so it was perfect, they say, okay. 
Let's start a taxi out to uh, the runway. Now this airport is very beautiful guys, so as I said marketplace uh, discount right now and uh, you won't regret if you buy it guys. Can look outside view. You want to see the livery? <laughs> All right. Government grounds, Nordic uh, Pipe Four, Tango Three, Six, Six, Six. For Tango Juliet, uh, we'd like to take Bravo 8 intersection. Oh, right, sure, that's fine. Uh, yeah, whiskey and Sierra holding with Bravo 8, turn B1, I know it. Taxi uh, by uh, whiskey uh, Mr. Do you use any other graphics Bravo mod from NVIDIA or, just, say, or is it just Juliet. all pure ultra graphics? Uh, it's, it's, I'm actually using, I'm using uh, the NVIDIA graphic three, filters. Uh, two, 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 First Bronco 782, contact number 118 bye bye. 118 Bronco 780, thank you, bye bye. Uh, Scandinavian 478 is Ground, so it's a first right on the mic, then hotel, then the 6 4. Mic and hotel. Uh, and and Paul, oh, thank you so. Good night, one seven eight eight. And Rick nine three two, same two. Contact tower one one eight two three. Bye. -bye. Okay, yeah, we're gonna hold here. Let's see, one one eight decimal three. Thank there you. Thank you. Carmen Tower, good evening. Bronco seven eight zero at holding point Alpha seven. The Bronco seven eight zero tower. Hello. Lima Fox at uh, Alpha. Uh, remain east of uh, the line uh, zero one and right. Order east of uh, zero one right. Lima Fox Alpha. Lima Take off when we force the 
Lufthansa 863, negative, hold position, negative. Hold position, sorry. Lima November, Alpha Charlie Echo. Lima Charlie Echo. Lima November, Alpha Charlie Echo, runway 1 and red, cleared for takeoff, winds 240 degrees, neither stop. When airborne, is used the shortest way possible, east of satellite, zero one right. One on a right, clear takeoff, one airborne, short sway east of zero one right. Uh, Lima Charlie Echo. Lima Foxtrot uh, Alpha, report leaving uh, Meyer Space. We'll call Lima Foxtrot Alpha. Government Tower, good evening. Nordic 5 for Tango Juliet on Sierra Taxi to Hodenbräun, Bravo 8. Nothing, it's nothing about right, yeah, power PPR. Hello, I'm back. Welcome back, Snap King. Uh, nice to have uh, you here with us. Snap uh, 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 is it? Yes, it is. Yeah, Luxe Flight, have a good flight, Bronco. Thank you, thank you, Luxe Flight. Line up runway 19 left, Nordic 5 for Tango Juliet. Uh, Musti, what's your favorite airline you love Tower flying with, except for SAS, Norwegian and Eurowings? You mean here in simulator or real life? Uh, do you go to Serbia sometimes in real life? Yes, I do. Last time was a couple of years ago, I think it's maybe five, six years ago, I was back in Serbia. My friends, we are just waiting for clearance to take off. Now it is your turn. Head on one and right, clear for takeoff, wind 240 degrees, 9 or not. Traffic information, light aircraft just departed, he is now routing east of your departure track. Thank you very much. Uh, for takeoff for now on right to Ofton 9063. I love your oh, love, you you're the best. <laughs> thank you, Snapkin, thank you. Much appreciated, very kind words from you, my friend. Bronco 780, line up runway uh, uh, 19 right. Line up uh, runway 19 right, Bronco 780. Uh, Lima for Alpha Tower, hello. Uh, Shorty leaving airspace at 1900. Come on, dude. Lima for Alpha, frequency change uh, approved. No reported traffic and traffic information with uh, approach 120450. Goodbye. Mr. Yeah, yeah, what's your favorite airline you love flying in the simulator? I don't prefer any particular airline, to be honest. I love jumping between different airlines. It's always fun to do different deliveries, so I don't have any particular... Yeah. Mr. ever thought about getting an eye tracker? Yes, I have. Uh, but uh, maybe in the future? Snuff King, take off time. Yeah, man. Let's just wait for the clearance. Clear for takeoff one on the right, Bronco 780. Here we go, guys. Nordic 932, line up just by one on the right. Lining up one on the right, Nordic 9. Please. Lima Echo leaving your airspace 2000, Lima Charlie Echo, thank you very much. Uh, no report to traffic, take off the change to the group. Traffic information available with the uh, Four five zero. Goodbye. Onboard traffic. Yeah, traffic is changed approved, and traffic information will be provided. Contact. 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 Oh, 
there's something off with my rudders. Let's go. We need to. That was very hairy. I think there's some issue with my rudders. They are just too sensitive. Gear up. Going to one to one to zero four five zero Bronco seven zero. Okay, autopilot is on. Let me set the one to zero four five zero. Something is off with my rudder, guys. There is uh, some issue. <laughs> I need to check out. We go four five zero. There we go. Eight, eight, seven, five. Thank you. To go, it flaps up. Game for you. Seven eight six. Thank you for subscribing. Welcome to the channel. Uh, just verify, confirm QNH1011. SFTF1011. Okay. Carbon approach, uh, good evening. Bronco 780 passing 4000 feet, climbing 7000 feet. Bronco 780, slow approach, uh, low identified, climb flight level 210. Climb flight level 210, Bronco 780. Go, level 210, ground spoilers off. Okay, back with you guys. Uh, Musti, did you have flaps on? Yes, I have flaps one for takeoff. Uh, everything was correct. Uh, I have experienced a little bit uh, issues with my rudders, which has been worse since the last stream. So I had to check them out now. It wasn't that long ago my side stick broke down. I had to buy new. So Nordic next, Tango, next Tango, I Tango, definitely Tango, need to check Tango, out Tango, my Tango, rudders Tango, Tango, because my rudder pedals, something is off with them, I don't know. Pedro Bronco Urban style takeoff. Come on, man. It's not that usually. It's second time it happens, so <laughs> usually we are not having that <laughs> all over the runway. Oh, it's still winter over here. Left heading 140, climb flight 210, good command. Long both 960, clear ILS, 190 left. Left 16, clear ILS, 190 left. Okay, let's switch off the landing lights. Uh, Musti, my side stick broke too. It's always the rudders. Are we talking about the TC8 side stick here? Yes, TC8 side stick, but that's, that works perfectly now. I have had it for a couple of weeks now. The All the TC8 side stick I had, uh, I had for more than three, almost three years, I think. So it was about time to switch into new, but the rudder pedals uh, are getting uh, some issues right now. So I have to look into that, guys. Hopefully we don't have issues on landing. Enough. I hope we don't get out of my failure. <laughs> yeah, man. <laughs> I'm with you there. Bronco 
Going to Polaris 118, Desmond A775. Goodbye, Bronco 70. Okay, switching the frequency again. 118, Desmond 875. Let's see if it's correct. Yes. Polaris Control, good evening, Broco 780, passing flight level uh, 120, uh, climbing flight level 210. Bronco 780, Polaris Control, climb flight level 340. Climb flight level 340, Bronco 780. Pedro, yes, I understand your takeoffs are very beautiful, but sometimes that happens. Well, now, you know, it's the second time in a row uh, we streamed on a Sunday as well. We had the same issues. It was very, very twitchy for some reason. It's like oversensitive or something. Uh, and now it got even worse this time. So I really have to look into that. Uh, the same thing happened with my side stick. Uh, it was way too sensitive. No matter what I did uh, before it broke down, uh, at the time it broke down, before I... I couldn't do anything, man. It was so, so sensitive. So, it feels like I need a new set of rudder pedals. And most the same issues with the TCSI stick are the cable which get tighter and tighter. You just got to release the pressure by going into the side stick, okay? Snuffkin, today I bought cat. <laughs> Congratulations. Okay, my dear passengers, we can switch off the seatbelt sign and uh, hope you enjoy the flight. Ah, this view is a little bit better. Like the snowy mountains over there. out the map for you guys as well. Nordic 5 for Tango Juliet, Unicorn Monte 2 decimal 8. Monte 2 decimal 8, uh, Nordic 5 for Tango Juliet. So my friends, have you had a great week? We are in the midweek Wednesday. Also a little bit of announcement. Uh, you guys who are not not with me, not uh, members of my Discord server. Usually we stream uh, Wednesdays and Sunday. Uh, but uh, starting this week, we're gonna stream uh, Wednesdays and Saturdays. 
Uh, this is mainly because uh, Sundays, uh, when I stream on Sunday, it's co it get, gets quite late in the evening and usually I work Monday mornings. So each week when I stream, stream on Sunday, I start my week with very little sleep and it's been very stressful. It's been very tough on my health. I've been feeling very tired uh, as I have too little uh, to sleep. So I moved the Sunday stream uh, to Saturday and because I don't have to go up early on su Sunday morning. We can also do uh, longer flights on Saturdays as well. So for all of you who are following me and uh, watching my live streams on Sundays, uh, remember this, uh, we're going to go on Saturdays instead. Snapkin, uh, did you hear the Emirates H350 news? I'm going to Dubai to see it. What what news about the H350, man? They don't hear it. Stopping Emirates add A350 to their fleet. Okay, okay. Well, to be honest, I didn't know about their fleet. I didn't even know that they didn't have any A350. Right, 9832, you Bronco, say even 80, Unicom, one question, got a coupling control, 136, move 485. Over to Copenhagen, 126, Bronco 780, thank you, bye bye. Okay, Delta, I'm gonna close soon, Unicom, 128. Over to Unicom, thank you very much, have a good night. Over to Unicom, 863. Copy and control, uh, Bronco 780, flight level 250, climbing flight level 340. Bronco 780, copy, going to the flight level 350. Lapsing here, 3204, clear to Gilbert, let me down, Snappy, what is our airspeed? Uh, right now, our airspeed is 447 knots. Grant, Woodley, I <laughs> you laughed out loud, Grant? Uh, at what, man? Anyway, welcome to the stream, Grant Woodley. Snafki, my cat is a black, beautiful man. 
Scandinavian so, 1761 ready practice. It's just a little kitten then, right? Scandinavian 1761 taxi holding point runway uh, 2 right line, taxi way Yankee and Alpha Cross runway uh, 3 0. Roger, taxi runway 2 2 by Yankee and Alpha Cross runway 3 0, Scandinavian 1761. Five one one contact uh, Bremen radar frequency one two three two 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 five. Also Bremen uh, one two three decimal uh, two five for Scandinavian five one hand uh, Scandinavian four two zero with the Atlanta. Four three zero. You are clear to land runway two two left. Uh, wind two six zero one two. Sorry. To the left, Kettler and the Scandinavian 42. Pedro, we know it's a little bit... Scandinavian 2256 at 6,000 feet. So I need to lower the voice of the ATC. Pedro, Norway is very beautiful in winter. Everything is covered with snow, principally the mountains. Indeed, Norway is a very beautiful country. They have lots of lots of what they call fjords, which is uh, inlets of uh, of the ocean uh, right in between the mountains, and it's so so stunning, man. It's a really beautiful beautiful country. Snapke, I'm planning to buy H30, but the model one. Okay, so you are building models. We reach fast in the ocean. Clear yeah. by ILS This is the flight, but we are soon okay, over Denmark. Uh, so that's where this is just a little bit of fly over the ocean right here. But uh, once we reach Denmark, it will be completely over uh, land. So here is our destination, Ljubljana, which is uh, we're gonna cross uh, Denmark. I we're gonna fly over Germany, uh, over to uh, Czech Republic, down a little bit over. Uh, I think we're gonna fly over Austria and straight down to Slovenia. Uh, Snapkin, do you want to be a pilot? You know. Now I have reached that age uh, when you don't even think about those things. Uh, maybe if I was doing it w when I was younger, I never thought about being a pilot. I was never an aviation enthusiast. Actually, I was very much afraid of flying way back. So uh, at that point, I didn't, uh, didn't think about being a pilot. Now, if I would start seeming, being a sim pilot, maybe 20 years ago, 25 years ago, when I was young, maybe then I would have second thoughts and maybe wanted to be a pilot. But as of now, you know, I, it's too late for me, man, if, uh, even if I wanted. So I don't even think about it. But yeah, I was afraid of flying before when I was young, man. We are controlled at the 863. We are for 15 minutes out of the all copies. Uh, that's the 863. We report back, thank you. Scandinavian 2256 established, I left on 22 left. Scandinavian 2256. Okay, we reached our yes, cruising altitude. Two, 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 two. 
It's not king, I think about plane every day. You do? So you want to be a pilot, ma'am? Not uh, yeah, I want to be a pilot, but yeah. my dad don't like me to be a pilot. Really? Why is that? Because my dad don't like me to be a pilot. because you don't want to spend money on me. May I ask where you live, Snapkin? Okay, I live in London and USA. Okay, but can't you like take student loan to pay for your education? I'm starting to work online. Okay, that's a great way to do it. Start saving up money. All I can do, don't give up on your dream. Uh, nobody should stop you from dreaming and want to achieve what you want to achieve. Uh, if your parents are unable to pay for your education, you have to find some other way. Start working uh, and uh, saving up some money and later on maybe looking at some kind of student loan now i know here in sweden where i live it's it's very beneficial for students you, you everybody are uh, you don't have to have any show anything a anybody are able to to get a student loan as as long as you have uh, got an education and you have a school to go to you are uh, able to get a student loan here in sweden so Cliff Landing, good evening captain and crew, good evening Cliff Landing, welcome, welcome on board, nice to have you with us. Taxi to stand Bravo 8 via Bravo Yankee Mike, it's going to be with 2256. Snuff King, thanks man, no worries man. 
I hope uh, that you achieve uh, the dream, the, 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 your dream, man. I really hope that you do that. Uh, Stavke, we are over Denmark now? Correct, we are over Denmark. And enemy 2256 at holding point Bravo, because the uh, cross from the uh, one two. Uh, Stavka, do you use paperwork to fly a plane in SIM? Can you explain what you mean? Yeah, no. Ask. Uh, I I didn't understand how what you mean by the question. Use paperwork. Do you mean that I like, use like uh, pen and paper to write something or I don't? Uh, I'm not following you on your question, man. Three thousand feet. Three thousand feet. Plane control, good evening. Uh, Nordic 54 Tango Juliet at flight event 3701 Nordic. Nordic 54 Tango Juliet. I don't know how to say it. Okay, we leave it as that, man. We leave it as that. A question uh, unanswered. Report established, uh, your name is Fafa Lima, if you're at ILS 2 to left, turn right heading uh, 100. Uh, Stavke, today is Eid in Arabs country. Okay, that... I don't know what that is, man. Is it some Muslim... celebration or something? Sorry, man. Uh, never heard of Eid. I don't know what it is. To <laughs> okay. okay, man. Okay, man. 
Yes, uh, Naki, are we in 30,000 feet? Yes, we are flying at 34,000 feet right now. Oh, Major looks real. Indeed, it does. Yeah, man, it's really beautiful. Lapol, I think you just missed uh, the fun part. Uh, now we had the cabin announcements uh, or safety announcements, custom made cassette announcements, which I played out uh, when we started to push back from the gate. So I, if you haven't heard those, I recommend that you rewind the stream back when we start pushing from the gate and <laughs> they're quite hilarious if you ask me. Uh, those are made by Liam, uh, the, our very own uh, IT technician here on the channel. Uh, he made those without my knowledge, so quite funny, man. You heard it? <laughs> okay. Nice, nice. Oh, well, major find it difficult to tell the difference. Well, that that's where the graphics are on point then, because I have to I have tuned them myself via the and media graphic filters, trying to make it as realistic as possible. Snuffing engine view is the best. Yep, I like the engine view as well, man. Oh, mate. He said safe flight, nothing is safe when you are in control. <laughs> no. oh. Well, love of God, don't let me be a real pilot. But I don't know guys, I must be the extreme magnet of all the issues you can have. If you are if I don't have issues with my peripherals, side stick, or now now my rudders are something wrong with, then we have a graphic cards issue. If I don't have issues with the graphic card, then it's something with the stream. If it's not the stream, then it's I don't know. Something in the simulator getting lost at the airports uh, hard to hear ATCs I mean yeah <laughs> such a magnet for all the issues guys <laughs> never a dull moment no Snuffkin, flight upside down. Yeah, if somebody could Copy put it off, it would certainly be me, man. Really certainly. <laughs> wow, the views are beautiful today. Almost that I feel that it's uh, now we are approaching to summer, summertime. And during the summer, I mean, the weather is so good uh, usually, so it's rarely any clouds when you fly during the summer. 
if it's not expe exceptionally bad summer, but you know when it's uh, clear sunshine and good weather, so it's rarely any clouds, and I really enjoy flying with the clouds. Mm, a snapkin, but I think yoke feel better in plane. Maybe if I was flying with Boeing, seven, uh, but uh, yeah, I like size. Now, now it feels a really good size. It feels a really good since I switched to the new one. Uh, much better control. Now <laughs> the next it's my rudder pedals. Yeah, it's a money drain. This simulator. I mean, it's a real money drain. Always had to buy some new, new, new stuff. <laughs> Pomejo, I think 737 has been rolled. No, did I do that? I don't think so. Did I did I do roll with 737? Uh, uh, On a uh, test it's flight. Are oh, you mean like in real life? Okay. The views behind Roger, the wings are the best for me. You. Okay, so you mean like we have this view. Imagine real life. Yeah, I, I, I understood that you were talking about real life. But I think right now the views from the right side uh, of the aircraft is more beautiful. There's a Washington road in the film Flight. Yeah, I love that movie. I mean, that air crash was the best part of the movie, if you ask me. I agree the rest of the film is a bit crap yeah I, I never saw it coming I mean when I saw the the movie flight about Denzel Washington being a pilot I mean I'm like wow I so wanted to see that and it started really good with the air crash and everything but uh, eventually uh, it uh, became to be a story about alcoholism which um, yeah it the last part maybe yeah, after the crash, maybe a bit afterwards, it was a little bit dull, to be honest. Atlantic 8 and 9, Copenhagen, you are identified to clear the tank, Copenhagen, Rocket 3. But the scene, I Charlie mean, with, the, air, 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 with the aircraft crashing, it, it was amazing. Uh, Stuff King, did you see Top Gun? <laughs> oh, if I uh, if I seen Top Gun, yeah, man, I seen Top Gun, man. Uh, 
Pound, go. Both of them. Postman 870, pound more knock flat a bit. Top Gun is a classic, Postman indeed, Paul, indeed. Postman 870, uh, Pedro Papiano, uh, yes, the view of the uh, engine is also most beautiful. And then flat level uh, 90, really clear for really the Charlie arrival. Postman, it's in Lima. Automatic 8 to 9, direct to Nexo, descent flat level Oh, our Dutch friend, Tri Stocky. Good evening. Good evening, Tri Stocky. Welcome, man. Yo, 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 try. Uh, 1285, all discretion, push to start the proofs. All discretion, push to start the proofs, can you win 1285? Blue Max, I'm ready to turn right heading 137. Just okay, how are you guys? We are very good, thank you. Wednesday night streaming. Also, I have and been talking about uh, Charlie, that if you haven't read uh, the uh, announcement I made in Discord, I will switch uh, streaming from Sundays to Saturdays. I maintain present heading, some trip to Sierra Charlie. Nordic 932, turn uh, left, heading uh, 150. So, starting five this zero, week, we are going to stream uh, yeah, hello, on Saturdays. Thank you so much for the ATC. Thank you. Right, I want to send Russia. Come the day, you want to send Russia. Come on to the spike. One to two, that's one, thank you. The next one, I think it's X ray clear, I'll let's go to the left, stand Snapki, I will be your co-pilot. Uh, okay, okay, you are so most welcome, Snapki. Oh, man, you just made my Saturday. Thank you. Always a pleasure having you with me, Paul. As always, so happy that you're with us, man. Trust, okay, already Wednesday week is fast as always. Incredibly fast. I mean, it was just yesterday. I was 20 years old. Went clubbing. Having a good time. Then I woke up and what happened, man? What the hell happened? I'm starting to get gray hairs on my sideburns. Nordic uh, 54 Tango Julian, contact uh, plane model frequency 123, decimal 225. Just okay, I was already uh, halfway. Three, April, five, Nordic yeah, 54 Tango Julian, bye bye. Snuff King, we are leaving Denmark now. Exactly, we are still over Denmark. Uh, we'll be st uh, soon going, crossing the ocean over to Germany. Oh, Major, I have crazy. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I'm getting there slowly, man, as well. I'm getting there as well. As I have talking been talking with you guys I promise that uh, as soon if I ever hit uh, 10,000 subscribers I will go live with the camera so you can see me I think I'm gonna be all gray in my head <laughs> you're gonna be like man who is that old dude Make sure there's no birds. Uh, okay. Zero five, uh, Charlie, descent four five, 
Assistant Porter, speed, can edge 1027, some trip, zero five, Charlie. That's a trip, zero four, Charlie, turn right leading. Right, 090, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0. Okay guys, almost the whole Europe is covered with ATC today, except for Ljubljana Airport. Franco 780, contact Bremen 123, Desmond 225. We're going to Bremen 123, Desmond 225, thank you, bye bye. Is there a 514 report mark number? Uh, there's 514, thank you. Speed uh, mark decimal 77 or less. Remarada, good evening. Bronco 780 at flight level 340 with you. Bronco 780, Bremenreader, hello, identified. Uh, climb flight level 350. Climb flight level 350, Bronco 780. Uh, okay, Snapking, we are, we are going fast. Yeah, we have a tailwind of 53 knots. We are flying at ground speed of four, 504 knots. Now we get received a little bit more uh, clearance to fly to, to climb to flight level 350. Also, there is something else that you haven't seen, which I will show you. I will show you this is work of our livery artist Liam. Look at this guys. Look at that. A tribute to one of you guys, to all of you guys who have been with me for a very long time. Also, you are supporting me with the membership. You are all flying with me, guys. Whether you are online or not, man. Beautiful work by our livery artist, Liam. Uh, Paul Major, nice, thank you. No, thank you, Paul. Thank you for your support throughout the years. So thankful, man. Hey, Pedro, wow, 55 knots of tailwind. Yes, yes. Let me just, uh, just, me just uh, lower the voice of ATC. There we go. Adrian, nice livery. Thank you, Adrian. And you can thank the Liam, which is a, a livery uh, artist. Good evening, good evening to South 5599 uh, for a level 290 with you. Vroom <laughs> 7, hello Bronco and everyone. Good evening, Vroom, uh, dear friend. Welcome on board. Request climb May 10, 330 for a level. Five
Afkin, we are entering Berlin. Not quite, we are entering the north part of Germany. Uh, we are close to Berlin. Uh, we are very close to Sassnitz. Uh, it's Room 7, I just saw a little bit of the inside of the cabin, feeling very honored being included in delivery. Amazing work by Liam. Man, it's it's my way of saying thank you and having you with me when I'm flying Bronco Airways. You have been with me for so long, guys. You have been such a supportive uh, uh, to the channel, to me, and I don't know. I, I, it's it, it was just an idea that I and me and Liam worked through that uh, we wanted to include you in some way just to say thank you for being with me. It's a small gesture, it's a name, but uh, nevertheless uh, you have to know how much I appreciate your support guys. You, you're amazing and you're the reason I'm doing this. Musti, thank you man, it means a lot. No man, thank you as well, thank you as I said. You guys are mo most welcome, and it's uh, yeah, it's a, the, the, the smallest thing I can do. It's nothing that was a long bank angle. Ah, quite common, man. It was not that sharp of a turn, but it feels it feels worse than it looks actually, or it looks worse than it is. It's what I want to say. Talking about wow, the engine looks so good. The engine really fit the fit delivery. Yeah, it was amazing, amazing job uh, from Liam with delivery. Getting all the details. Uh, also very thankful to him as well for doing this for us. Omej, it's a pleasure to fly with you, Bronco, man. All love to you. Thank you. Uh, from someone I like the golden edge on the engine. Looks like a sleeve of a fancy suit. You know what it looks like? Like a military suit. Uh, you know, like a captain's... Uh, what do you say? Not suit, but uh, uniform. The parade uniform of uh, like a navy captain or something. You know, you have on the sleeves and you have like your uh, military grade ranks on your sleeve. That's what it looks like. Uh, Roger, tell us all five, five, nine, 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 direct to Gormid, Golf Oscar, Mike Echo Delta. Stop, can I feel like I'm in a plane? Well, that's the, that's the, that's the whole point, man. Talking man, keep it up, Bronco. You're the best man. Thank you, Talking man. Thank you very much, also. Uh, very appreciated that you are with me as well, my Swedish friend. Mr. You should be arrested and put into life sentence for being so nice. Is it a crime today to be nice? Looks really classy. Yeah, yeah. I'm there with you, Froom. I'm with you there. It's offending <laughs> to be nice these days. Yeah, maybe it is. Maybe you, you have a point there, man. You have a point there. I mean, so before the one unicorn wanted to eat you. I think that people are generally, or maybe young people, are not not uh, not used to be not used to that people can be nice. 
everything i think since the release of the social media all the social uh, i mean the the facebook the the instagram and whatever you know tiktok wherever you i mean uh, or maybe even so go back as a release of the internet we have been we are starting to being very lonely very introverted and less outgoing and people only tend to themselves they uh, i mean young people now hardly even know how to communicate when they meet a stranger uh, which makes uh, young people dating <laughs> a hard thing so yeah maybe it's a hard thing experiencing uh, like be someone being nice to you for no reason i don't know could be something behind it Talking about it's okay to sit with strangers on buses? For sure, why wouldn't? But you know, especially here in Sweden, people don't talk to each other. They don't talk to each other, right? Especially, especially strangers. I mean, it's so like... We just, we just don't uh, talk to each other. <laughs> if we don't know each other. It's so crazy, man. Cuban <laughs> Swedish buses are so funny when there's never two strangers sitting together. No, it goes to that point that sometimes, even when it's a seat available next to somebody else, there are people that uh, that they choose to stand up in the bus. They, they don't, don't sit there straight, they just stand up. It's, uh, I mean, it's crazy. It's just crazy, man. It's Sweden, yeah. Yeah. Okay, my friends, I'll be uh, talking, but I'm one of them. <laughs> Social distancing before it was popular. <laughs> yeah, man. I'll be right back with you guys. I'm gonna just pick up a, a, a cup of espresso. One kilo contact Ich bin irgendwie eine Art Antwort, ich 
gewartet. So, und Papa Bremen, leider hallo, identify. Okay guys, I'm back with you. Also a little bit of bad news as well. You know I was talking about in, uh, in Saturday in two weeks. Uh, there will be a uh, cross the pond event on Batsim. And there was a lottery of about when you are able to uh, to sign up, when you to, con to just connect with uh, and try to book a slot. So you have like a time when you can uh, join in and book a slot because there are so many many people that want to fly the, across the pond event and we want to fly we were talking about flying to princess juliana airport i'm not sure that we're gonna get that airport since the lottery uh we were uh, we went bad in the lottery i can say we are dead last when to choose uh, the connected flights so most of the flights are going to be gonna be chosen and I don't even know if there will be a slot available to book uh, so because there are so many people so they they said from the across the pond event uh, staff guys said that uh, if you are last like me I got the very last time uh, at Friday this week week uh, the, the booking has already started, but I'm not able to book, so maybe uh, it will be fully booked when I join and start to book a slot. So we, I don't even know if you're gonna do that event. So bad news, unfortunately. Yes, I lo lost the lottery, man. Uh, Clifford, what is the date of the event? Uh, it's not this Saturday, but next Saturday. Let me see to get my calendar. Just a minute. So this Saturday is April 13th. So April the 20th is the across the pond. But as I said, I'm not sure. You will. Uh, I will say to you. I will notice you on Friday evening if I get a get a slot. But now it's very uncertain. Room 7, damn, can win them all, I guess. Well, I won the lottery with the GPU, so I will be happy with that one. <laughs> Getting the free RTX 1490. And talking about, say you are a YouTuber, maybe you get a YouTube slot. <laughs> I don't know. I don't think they take it into consideration, man. Pedro, I'm just warning that the window seat is mine. Of course, it's of course it's yours. If we get a slot, uh, I will take whatever. Uh, hopefully, Princess Juliana landing. But yeah, I think that one will be popular, guys. I think very ma many people would like to go to Princess Juliana. So, but who knows? We will find out on Friday evening. Uh, it's uh, in two days' time. He right talking man <laughs> wrong sentence you wrote tip yeah you are welcome to tip man <laughs> i need new sets of the rudders rudder pedals
stop game. What means you serve in plain? Well, since this is a Swedish airline, we are serving Swedish meatballs with mashed potatoes and brown sauce. <laughs> Also, free snooze for everyone on the aircraft. <laughs> snooze at the side, yeah, man. Okay, I'm just gonna do a little fast thing because I actually I try to I change my sensitivity settings with rudder pedals. I'm gonna do that again. Uh, let me go really fast. Control options. So snucking with Air Japan airline is out. What? Uh, in one co in uh, which context, man? I, I totally could go for some Swedish meatballs right now. <laughs> yeah. Airline is Air Japan, okay. He's talking to me, I didn't uh, pay attention. One, two, three, that's my two, two, five. Bremen Radar, hello, identified. Aerodin 6 for Echo, Bremen Radar. Aerodin 6 for Echo. Bremen 6 for Echo, Bremen Radar, hello, identified. Bremen Radar, uh, Bronco 780, Vitya. Bronco 780, contact München, 133.230, tschüss. To mention uh, 123, that's my 230. Thank you, bye bye. Hello, Mission Radar, good evening. Uh, Bronco 780 at flight level 350. Bravo Charlie Oscar 780, Mention Radar, hello, identified.
Uh, sorry for him, Mr. Dolo was I'm getting her from Ikea. I will do a real... Someday I hope I can make you my homemade with elk meat. Meatballs. Mm. Room 7, we're going back for a quick shower. Okay. Roger, thank you. Snapking, we are in Germany now? Yes, we are in Germany. We have been for quite a while, man. All of this is Germany. Snuffing, I don't go to gym, but I go swimming. Well, swimming is also very good for you, man. Snapkin, bro, I'm going by now. Sorry, no, no problems, man. Thank you for joining. Thank you for flying with us today. Snapkin. 7027, contact Bremen Radar 123, that's on 225. Bye-bye. Thank you for joining. Thank you for saying hello. I wish you a great rest of the evening, man. And uh, hope you have a great... Bravo 780, when ready, descend to reach hands of you are at flight level 1990. Where do I need to descend? Say again, Bronco 780? Uh, Bronco 780, disregard. Roger. Uh, hello, um, Berlin 552 at flight level 350 with you inbound to KLF. Berlin 552, München, hello, identified. Descent flight over 330, direct Glasdorf, Kilo, Lima, Foxtrot. Descent flight over 330, direct Glasdorf, Berlin, Bank of Two. München, Six Tango Bravo, flight over 330. Six Tango Bravo, München, hello, identified. Descent flight over 310. Delta, contact Ryan, 133, that's number 655. Goodbye. Contact Ryan, Delta, 133, that's number 655. Check. Delta. Six, 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 Mini Grader, schönen guten Abend, Lufthansa vor Papa Lima, inbound, Sordo. Lufthansa vor Papa Lima, München, hallo, identified. <laughs> Welcome back, Snapkin. That was a quick one.
I was knocking, I went to eat something and I didn't farm to eat something. Oh, that's a bummer. No snack at all at home? <laughs> and I ordered Subway. <laughs> Sounds great, man. Aberdeen 552, the Sunflatable 200. Sunflatable 200, Berlin 552. 10 pounds is kind of expensive for Subway? That's really expensive, man. Nordic Alpha Tango Julia, proceed direct Armut. Direct Armut, Nordic Alpha Tango Juliet. Again, to Berlin 552, please. Evelyn 552, proceed direct Delta Bravo 462. Delta Bravo 462, Berlin 552. Hi, Mitchell. Policy service, Rhino 20, Victor X-ray 3702, Lasso CPDLC. Rhino 20, Victor X-ray, Mitchell. Hello, identified. Mitchell Radar, good evening. Direct 420, Mönchen, hello, identified, direct Atkut. Direct Atkut, direct 420. Nordic 54 Tango Juliet, contact Mönchen, 133, that's number 565, tschüss. 133, 565, November 5, uh, Nordic 54 uh, Tango Juliet, ciao, danke für den Service. Bravo, proceed direct Delta Bravo 462. Delta Bravo 462. ICR 532, contact Mönchen 133, that's number 565. Bye bye. Contact Mönchen 133, 565. Okay, bye bye. Stopping is getting night, you mean here in Simulator? Not quite really, we are in late afternoon. It's still. It's, it's it will be still daylight when we land in Ljubljana, so... Ah, in real life, okay. Not in the current database. Only 461 and 463. Haha, so 6 Tango Bravo, okay. Yeah, then when that's worse, we need 461. That's the top of the side. Alles klar, direkt Delta Bravo 461. Für 16 Uhr. Menschen Räder, guten Abend, Austrian 238, Passing Flat Double 185, Climbing 250, Inbound, Hotel Delta Oscar. Austrian 238, Menschen, hallo, identified, Climb Flat Double 250. Climb Level 250, Austrian 238. Ah, Austin 238, ist das Level, ist ja 290 requested, dann Climb Level 290. Okay, danke, 290, Austin 238. Bronco 780, Contact KH 118, Decimal 375, vorbei. Going to Praha 118, that's 375, uh, Bronco 780. Thank you, bye bye.
Okay, let's switch the frequency. 118, 375. 118, good evening, Bronco 780 at flight level 350. Bronco 780, Praha Radar, good evening, identified, proceed direct uh, Lanux. Direct to Lanux, Bronco 780. Praha Radar, uh, good evening, unfortunately out of passing through flight level 307. Lufthansa for Charlie Hotel, Praha Radar, good evening, identified. Praha R6 Le Mayenki, contact Praha 127 decimal 58, goodbye. Contact Praha 127 uh, 58, the Niner 6 Le Mayenki, Joe. Praha R2, Niner Quebec Hotel, descent flight level 310. Descent 8310 for AM, uh, 2 Niner Quebec Hotel. Praha Radar, good evening, Central 746, uh, 5000 feet, uh, inbound. Control 746, wrong frequency, contact departure 120.53. Volux is uh, 001, clamp flight level 400. Clamp flight level 400, velocity is 1. Ryanair 290, Quebec Hotel, contact Vienna 134.35, right. 3435 for AM, Matanai, Kibikotel, Stone. Topine 4C, Rikes, Reprahari, Jack, Dimming, Identified. Uh, Snafkin, uh, Subway plus Fly Sim, best combo. Oh, enjoy your Subway sandwich, man. Uh, Let's check our flight. Uh, I haven't even Let's see how it looks. Our flight plan. Here we go. Now we have been directed from this waypoint uh, straight to Lanus. We are going to, like straight down there. And we're going to descend. Going flying a little bit over uh, the so we're gonna fly a little bit over the Alps here uh, in uh, the Austria down to waypoint Radley where we will descend to 8,000 feet uh, going down to 5,000 feet at this waypoint and let me just, we need to find, let me see, it's Lima Juliet, Lima Juliet, it's the Slovenia approach, runway ILS, there we go. Uh, so we're going to connect down here and turn right, it's a straight in ILS approach here on runway 30, quite beautiful mountains here on the, 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 Airport itself is Prime between the mountains. Kilo, here, so. Good evening, Kylian. Should be quite stunning approach. Direct Mikov. Direct to Mikov, uh, Renner, Renner, Kilo. Uh, yeah, I mean these papers. Oh, you mean like charts? Uh, yeah, navigation charts. Yeah, I have to use those. Especially when you're flying on the Batsim, uh, you always have to have the have those charts just to know uh, which waypoints to use and also it's uh, yeah, you, you couldn't fly without a man.
Vision for Romeo Kilo Praha, Radar, good evening, book 1000. Vision for Romeo Kilo, identified. Praha, good evening, so you're in 70 Alpha, flight 360, you're in 70 Alpha. You're in 70 Alpha, Praha, good evening, identified. Uh, good evening, Austin 238, flight level 290, Austin 238, Praha Radar, Briscoe, identified, proceed to direct Mikov. Direct Mikov, Austin 238. Student of 4 Charlie Hotel, when ready, descend flight level 250 to reach level at Bezu. When ready, the central area to reach and the reach of the top left in the Fortune Hotel. Liam Fried, hey Liam, how long is this flight? Well, we are uh, only 220 nautical miles until we reach our destination, so we still have maybe maximum one hour, maybe. Not even that. I would, I would say maybe 45 minutes until we land. Stuff King, nice music. Oh, glad you're enjoying it, man. Ah, uh, right now. Hello, this is five Quebec Lima, Praha Radar, good evening, identified uh, runway 24, Lomki 8, air arrival. Lomki 8, runway 24, this is five Quebec Lima. Transavia 86, uniform Praha good evening, identified. Gary, in 40,000 40, feet? No, we are flying at 34,000 feet. Uh, Christos, when are we doing a Atlantic again? 342, Praha Radar, good evening, identified. Calm flight level 170, proceed direct Lanuk. Uh, we will see that man, uh, I'm not sure, uh, Saturday in two weeks, April 20th, there is a Cross the Pond event. But uh, my lottery ticket for the sign up for a booking a slot, uh, I got it quite late. I'm one of the last people able to, to sign in and book a slot. So I don't, I'm not sure we're going to get a, a slot for that flight, but we will see, man. It's uh, uncertain at this point.
Student of Fort Charlie Hotel, contact München, one two nine decimal one. Bye. One two nine decimal one, the Student of Fort Charlie Hotel. Thanks for the evening. Is six five Quebec Lima, contact Praha, one two seven decimal five eight. Bye. One two seven decimal uh, seven eight. Alihan, hello Alihan, welcome to the stream, welcome to the channel. How do you set the camera? Good evening, uh, If you find a website called flightsim.to, and uh, when in that website, just search for in the search engine for custom um, custom window views. There you will be presented with lots of lots of options to, to download a mod that sets your window views, man. Liam Free, will you fly a long haul flight when Lightning VFR is releasing the A340? Most certainly not. Because I have just limited time uh, when I stream. I can do m at the longest maybe flights about 3 4 hours. Uh, a long haul is maybe 8 hours, something like that. And yeah, I'm not sure, man. I cannot answer that right now. So probably not, man. I don't know if I'm going to buy A340. I'm going to see the reviews first if it's any good. Uh, Snapkey, it looks more than 30,000 feet. No, it's 34,000 feet, man. Christos, just like, like Zurich to Cancun in Edelweiss, HG40 would be crazy. As I said, we will see what happens, man. Uh, Alihan, thanks, man. And also, you, uh, which add-on you use for replays, for landing, etc.? I don't have... I don't ha I don't have any good add-on for replays, but I have heard that there's a really good add-on also that say very same uh, website. So you should search there as well. Search for replay tool and uh, search for uh, reviews about it. So I'm most certain that you will find some good add-on for replays. Oh, it seems like we're a little bit of cloudy weather when we come to Ljubljana. Vision 2 Delta Whiskey, Flight 4 3, hold. Vision 2 Delta Whiskey, Prahara, good Australian one to go, to see direct Mazur. Direct Mazur also. Bronco 780, contact Vienna, 134.35, goodbye. Going to 134.35, Bronco 780, thank you, bye bye. And then on a kilo, descent flight level 130 to cross me. Yeah. 
Vienna Radar, good evening. Broco 780 at the flight level 350 with you. Broco 780, Service Wien, Radar contact. Wien Radar, hello, Lufthansa 400, Service Wien, Radar contact. Lufthansa 400, Service Wien, Radar contact. Yeah, there's a lot of people from 2K to the Victor. 2K to the Victor, go ahead. Oh, V-Speeds! Hello, my friend! Welcome! my back finally was not really a quick shower anyway welcome back from Are you able to fly Mach decimal 80 or greater on plus 340? Confirm, are you able Mach decimal 80 or greater at cruise level? Uh, 13000 Are you able to cruise at Mach decimal 8.0 or greater? It's 
Tough game, my cat is watching you live. Oh, say hello to the cat. Ask the cat to subscribe and hit the like button, okay, man. Confirm <laughs> able or unable. Oh, we have trouble with ATC. Oh. Uh, <laughs> okay, Bamboo 265 on conversion, mark decimal 80 or greater. Someone didn't do his ATC homework. No. I don't think he knows what he's talking about. Yeah, it's tough, man. You want to fly on Watsim and you haven't learned everything. It's it's not that easy. It's so painful to listen. You can really hear how he doesn't know what to say. <laughs> Boston 188 to Century Reach, level 170 at Masur, on conversion speed 280 knots or less. Check 118 speed 280 knots or greater, contact 134, that's 675, goodbye. Speed 280 knots or greater, and 134, that's 675. One more eight goes. Bye. Hey, Dad. Yeah, but I'm going to have to have to Good evening, this is for the 385 at flight level 30 with you. Help Italian! <laughs> so 521, contact me. We live and learn, I guess, yeah, man. Well, I love Italians. <laughs> Okay, are we looking only about 55 miles until we start our descent? And we need to enter the destination data. Okay, let's head into MCDU and performance performance page and go to next phase, next phase as well. Approach, uh, we have QNH is 1026. Temperature in lovely Ljubljana today is at 10 degrees. So keep your bathing suit packed in, don't bring it out yet. Wind is 290. Nine zero at four knots. Also one to call speed two eight zero knots or greater. Contact one three four. Transition altitude. Let's see. Uh, is ten thousand five hundred feet and minimum decision altitude. Greater and one three four six seven five. Is uh, one thousand three hundred and ninety-one feet. Ten five hundred. That is correct. Six three one three. Climb flight level three six zero. Climbing 360, marking 6313. Okay. Quality 8841, when ready, descent level 170, expect Amadi level 130. Okay, when ready, descent level 170, expect Amadi at uh, level 170. Quality 8841. Also 188, contact Wien 134675. Okay. Snuffkin, luckily, is not stormed today in flight sim. Uh, at least uh, not where we are. Right descent uh, flight level 210 and Cross Ladex 240 or below. Descent flight level 210 and cross Ladex 240 or below. Delta Hotel Papa. Quality 8841, contact Wien 132, that's my 190. Bye. 
Okay, 1190. Let's see if that's correct. Uh, it's 110.5. 110 110.5, that's correct. Also, let's see which flight that we need to be level at. 780, descent flight level 310. Descent flight level 310, Bronco 780. Okay, let's start our descent. Papa contact Wien, 134, level Going to 134.675, Delta Hotel Papa. Los Aires, Galima, proceed direct, um, correct, proceed direct Matic. Los Aires, Galima, direct to Matic. Modeling 6313, contact Wien, 132.195. Okay, we are very close to Slovenia, so we're gonna quit the map. Uh, so, Modeling 6313. Local 780, contact Wien 134, correction 132, decimal 190, bye. Going to 132, 132 decimal 190, Bronco 780, bye bye. 265, contact München 129, decimal 1, goodbye. 129, decimal 1, so far, thank you, what's the good? Confirm call sign. Aber boy, it's too far, sorry, I'll do it. Passing 6313, service and radar contact. Continue climb 360. Continue climb 360. Being a radar, Bronco 780, descending flight level 310. Bronco 780, service and radar contact. Expect to cross Radley level 200 or below. Report ready for further descent. Expect to cross Radley at 200 or below. Uh, is uh, I'm a Bronco 780, is ready for descent. Bronco 780, Roger, descent level 130, cross Radley 200 or below. Descent 130, cross Radley 200 or below, Bronco 780. Quality 8841, contact München 120, uh, 780, bye bye. München 120, 780, quality 8812. Lufthansa 8, Alpha Foxtrot, now it's your turn, 120780. Schönen Abend, Servus. Confirm 120780, Lufthansa 8, Alpha Foxtrot. 120780. 120780, Lufthansa 8, Alpha Foxtrot, schönen Abend, Lufthansa 8, Alpha Foxtrot. Delta, Oscar Delta, descent level 120, 1500 feet per minute, or greater. Descending 110, 1500 feet, or greater, Delta, Oscar, Oscar, Delta. Pedro, let's start descending. Indeed, it may be a little bit turbulent descending as we are going to descend over the mountains here. And we're already seeing the, those beautiful mountains. Oh, it just looks incredible. Look at the light uh, trying to pass the the clouds and all those small clouds over the mountain. I mean, oh wow. Delta Oscar Delta contact uh, Salzburg 12375. Servus. One two three seven two five. Tschüss, schönen Tag noch Delta aus Kanada.
<laughs> Rooms have a nice view and all, but eyes on the roll cat. <laughs> Just kidding. Yeah. Uh, this is why we do this, guys. For these views. I mean, come on, man. Okay, I need to check our descent. So we are on the... Yep. Yeah, descending nice and slowly. Uh, to Ljubljana, does anyone know how to say this name? Yes, I know. Uh, Ljubljana. So how do we order beer in Slovenia? I think it's something like Jedno pivo molimbas. It should be closer. I mean, the language Slovenian is um, not easy to understand if you're Serbian. But they have similar language, but it's still very far away. Yeah, sure what he said. <laughs> well, that was actually in Serbian. Well, yet no people. It's one beer. And molin was meaning, uh, please. Room 7 being room 7, yeah. <laughs> okay, let's hit the seat by sign button. Oh, we have a little bit of turbulence here. Uh, Stop game working and watching you live and chilling with my cat. Nice. Stopking, I worked one hour and I get 34 pounds. Nice. That's a really good pay, man.
<laughs> I got my subway money back. <laughs> yeah. So basically, you were eating for free, almost. Well, you had to work for it, but yeah. Win win. Going to Unicorn 122 Decimal 8, thank you, bye bye, Rocco 780. Smart Link 6313, monitor Unicorn 122 bye bye. 122 Decimal, thank for guidance. Your wings 22 November, contact the uh, Wien 134350, bye bye. The Wien 134, that's not Let's descend to 5,000 feet. Snuff King, I'm just working with my keyboard. A320 cockpit is beautiful, yes indeed. I don't know if I think maybe the most beautiful, maybe because it's all electronic. I really enjoy this Boeing 787. It looks so modern. I want to be a 787-9 pilot, dash 9, oh, as I said, chase your dream, man, nothing is impossible. From uh, both cockpits have both their charm. Airbus is well automated and does its job well. With Boeing, I like pushing buttons. <laughs> yeah, especially with old Boeings. I mean, 737, we have, uh, I don't know, the new Max version, but it's like a broken plane flying right now. But the, the, the old 737, lots of lots of uh, setting up to do. It feels very manual for some reason. Okay, let's focus on our approach now.
the old 747 is harder. Could be. I haven't flown 747 in Microsoft Flight Simulator like ever. <laughs> From the 747-200, they still had an engineer on board monitoring all kinds of stuff. Three-man crew flying, yeah. That that were, were the days, man. Wing flex. Oh, yeah, we have a little bit of wing flex. Yeah, Snuffking, that's a nice view. Indeed, very nice view over the mountains. Yeah, very close to doing our turn. Uh, Pretty close to the mountains, guys. Okay, there is the runway. Okay, localizer is captured. We fly a little bit fast.
Okay, we are way above our... My friends, we're going manual. Let's see if we can catch this. There was an issue, something that it didn't. Let's see if we can. We are very high. We might go, uh, might do a go around, my friends. Flaps one. Okay, we might catch it, guys. One thousand. Let's go gear down. This is a go around, guys. Too low terrain. We are way too fast. Too low terrain. Too low terrain. Laps one. Gear up. <laughs> Never a dull moment. No. Okay guys, we are doing a go around. We were a little bit too fast. The stop can I think you have to be around 100 to land or 120. Well, it's I think the landing should be around 130 between 130 knots and 140 with full flaps down. And we're gonna follow this. Uh, you see on my map, we're gonna follow this uh, little flight path. I'm gonna. 
light manual Even more time to enjoy the views, my friends. Now the next thing, how is, uh, how are we with the fuel? We have, uh, we still have 3.7 tons of fuel, so we are, we are good on the fuel. Yes, we have enough of fuel, man. And we have City of Ljubljana to the left of us, guys. <laughs> Pedro, it was a beautiful go around. Indeed. I think you have to do a hard running because it's a short runway. E I don't think it's that short. Uh, Snap King, is the autopilot on? Yes, the autopilot is on. Okay, let's see if we are set. We have landing lights are on. Auto brake is set to low. Let's uh, arm the ground spoilers. Gear down. And go with flaps one.
we can see the airport in the distance to the left. Here we go guys, attempt two. And maybe even go as low as 3000 feet. Flaps two and flaps full. Okay, we should catch the local at any minute now. There we go, local at is captured. Little bit better prepared. And the glide slope is captured as well. <laughs> Looks much better now, guys. Uh, we have a slight tailwind from the right. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Bronco living up to his own company slogan. I will get there eventually. <laughs> well, everybody needs to do a go around now and then. And since you never landed here before, usually pilots get the train on the approaches and stuff before they go there. And we are just first time. I don't know why. I it, it didn't feel like we were high up, but we had the speed was very high. We didn't get to slow down in time. Anyway. Here's the final approach. Stuff can you hope it's a butter? Yeah, I hope so as well. Ljubljana traffic, uh, Bronco 780, uh, five miles final, uh, runway 30. Okay, cabin crew, get ready, get seated for landing, everything is set up, uh, ground spur is on, flaps full, uh, gear down, auto brake is set to low, uh, landing lights on, yep, we are fully ready my friends.
currently it will be only three or four knots of wind coming from the from the west okay autopilot off so ooh, now the wind has switched Okay, we were a little bit too fast to take this exit, we're gonna do a full runway. Uh, 279, yes, I flared a little bit too late. Anyway, it was quite nice landing. Let's go with flaps up. Ground spoilers off. on ladies and gentlemen i hope you enjoyed the flight and welcome to ljubljana slovenia bronco airways stood for your flight service today <laughs> At least we got some <laughs> nice views of the city. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, well, it's better to do go around and try to slam it down. Uh, I know in previous streams I always that did everything just to land it. I did, didn't want to do go around, but hey, why rush it down? It was very nice, very beautiful flight. Very twitchy, my my. Oh, you can see when I turn. Okay, uh, let's taxi to our gate. Uh, let's start the APU. And let's start the GSX, which is uh, once again not working. Oh, thank you. Uh, gate, uh, let gate. Nope, no, no, no. Which one? We don't want that. Uh, nope. We actually want the uh, change facility. Gate A, maybe. Uh, let's go with gate A. Uh, A5. And uh, no follow me. Now these uh, aircrafts you see on the airport, they come with the uh, scenery of the airport. They are just static uh, aircrafts, which I personally don't like why they do that. Uh, it's, uh, they are not that good looking and I don't know why they do that. I would uh, prefer more, don't having those static aircraft because it just, just ruins it. When you, especially when you're flying on Batsim, if you had maybe some other pilot here on, on this airport, maybe you just don't know is it a Batsim pilot or is it a static aircraft 
Hey Jerwell, I guess that was okay, <laughs> yeah. Uh, we take that this time. Can you remove it? I have to check if I can remove it. I have to search for uh, how to do it. Okay, gate 5 is over there. There is gate 6. And the next one is ours here. Okay, parking brake on. Lights off. There we go, sit by sign off. And ladies and gentlemen, let's commence day boarding. Let's see if gate works. Pedro Papiano, many details. It's quite beautiful, this airport. If I could remember where I got it and <laughs> who made it. Uh, Snuff King, thank you, Captain, for flying. Thank you very much. Kalaf, hello, welcome. <laughs> quite late, but anyway, I hope you enjoyed this flight as much as I did. Uh, loving this delivery. Once again, big, big thank you to our friend Liam for making this delivery for us. Uh, ah, gate is not working. <laughs> okay, okay. I think I think I need to uh, update my GSX. I, I haven't been checked if there is an update. There certainly must be some update because it has been bugging me quite a long time at every airport I arrive or 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 depart. Uh, anyway, uh, Snuffkin Power, thank you, Captain, for your flying. Thank you, guys. Thank you very much for joining today. Uh, Paul Major, thank you very much. Kalaf, uh, hey King, hey Kalaf, welcome. Nice to have you for such a brief time anyway. Uh, Frum7, Pedro Papiano, Paul Major, Kalaf, uh, Snuff King, Adrian, uh, Tristoki and everybody. Thank you so much for being with me on this flight today. The next one is on Saturday. As I said, we ch changed the streaming time. We are not going to stream on Sunday. This time will be on Sunday. We're gonna, uh, we are going to North America, guys. We're going to fly from... Uh, from Houston Airport, we're gonna go to Atlanta first. We're gonna deboard passengers, and we're gonna board new passengers. And after that, we're gonna fly to Chicago. So it should be quite nice. Only big airports on that stream, so it should be really nice stream. Uh, anyway, guys, if you ha if you have enjoyed this flight, please hit the like button. Uh, if you want to see more flights with me and haven't subscribed. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button. As I said, next time I will catch you on uh, Saturday. Kalaf, I'm waiting for my uh, Le, uh, Lima, Echo Bravo Lima to Lima Romeo Oscar Papa. Okay, have you wrote, wrote it down in the Discord server, man? Because uh, that's where I get my flights. I'm sorry if I haven't done it sooner because it's very hard for me to remember all the flights. So if you have a flight request, you have to enter it on my Discord server on the flight request uh, sub sub channel. Anyway, that's it for today. Thank you for uh, thank you everything for today. And uh, as I said, I will catch you next time on Sunday. No, <laughs> Saturday. Sorry for that. Saturday. It's the next time. My friends, have a good night. Have a great rest of your week. And I see you on Saturday, hopefully. Adios, arrivederci, and uh, dovigenia, how would they say in Slovenia? <laughs>